M0 FXB Radtel RT920 or the Badgeton 7800 8300. Someone said they can't get their radio to read via Bluetooth. Okay, so all you do is turn the radio on and turn on the Bluetooth on your device. Menu 48, Let's just go menu, type 48 and then select OK like so and then on and off will flash. When on is flashing, turn it on and just press OK. So that means it's on, okay? And you'll see that because at the top there's a little Bluetooth logo. Then you don't actually need to pair it with the phone. What I find is that you just download the app and a few of them work, but here's one that's called Ola that's listed uh, on the uh, AliExpress site. So on the left is the let's check, iOS, on the right, Android. We'll type in walkie talkie. That's the one I'm using. So it might make you create an account. Let's just go back. Frequency mode channel. Let's just go back with the back arrow. Come on then. So you'll start off here and then tap here and just when you go connect it will find it. If it doesn't find walkie-talkie it hasn't found it. Like so go walkie-talkie then model. Now you'll see that we've got the Radtel 920 here but if we go back you'll see that Badgeton are listed. 8300, 7800. Um, so we're going to go back and do Radtel. And look at all the other models. Yeah, you know, you've got both and you've got everything here. But anyway, Radtel 920 and we're connected. Now you go to frequency right and you can read all right. So we'll show you read. Give it a sec. That will scroll across. The radio will do that. It's a bit dark here and let's see if I can brighten it up a bit. Hopefully that helps. And you can see we've got my FTX1 in the background, it's been doing a few vids on that, adding the fan and the protective case. But anyway, here we are. So you can choose which zone you want to be in. But I'm just leaving it default with zone one. I don't really keep many memories. So then channels, choose the channels that you want to go into. Actually, we need to go into frequency mode. Let me just check. No, that's fine. Go back to channel info and notice that it's not really because I haven't added any memory. So it's only showing that one channel and it's not showing any more that it's not giving me the option to actually add more, which is weird. So I'm going to go click right and see what it does. OK, the reason it wouldn't let me select them is because I wasn't logged in. So you do need to log in when you create your account. So current zone. Let's try again. Ch channel. That's well, you can see what's happening. I can put in, hmm, not letting me select a channel number. If I go one, done. This is on the iPhone, by the way. I will test it on my Android. Um, so let's just put in a frequency first. Maybe you need that first. Enter, uh, four, three, four. And let's do TX five zero receive. Okay, CTCSS transmit ninety four point eight done. Oh, let's go down one done. Select the power, the bandwidth. All seems fine. Name, it's G, double tap for capitals, B, 3, W, R, done. Okay, so now, why won't it let me select the channel number? I'm just going to put in one. Go all the way back. I mean, you, I don't think that would work anyway. I, it's, in, it's white, that's why you can't see it. Well, I think that's that's the little bug that I'm finding with the iPhone. You can go to frequency mode and you can set frequency mode. And bands, look. VHF, UHF. And optional. That's all your settings. You've got your squelch level, power level, beep. I would say here, look for channel A, 
you want it to show channel mode maybe that will fix the problem done let's go back to channel info still no number unless it's there and I can't see it so we can't at the moment I'm not seeing that it lets us select um, the zone we want to use and the channel this is the iPhone one as I said I'm gonna go right oh now it wants me to log back in let's go back I can see the Bluetooth turned off so we go menu 48 So that's that's something worth knowing. When it when you write to it, it um it turned off the Bluetooth. We so anyway, it selected everything now. Go back here, channel info. It's lost everything I've just typed, of course. Let's just quickly go. I'm just trying to see if we can select channel number. No, let's quickly type that again. I'll message them anyway. I'll just do that and I'll put in the name. I've used the software on the PC. That worked. Again, no channel number. Right. And it is writing. So that's as far as I can go. I'm going to message them and say that the app, this app doesn't let me do the channel number. And then we could try the Ola one. On my, I've got that on my other phone, Ola.